Hello everyone, it's time for another vlog, of course. It seems like these are pretty frequent now because clearly my life is exciting. That's not true. Um, but yeah, tonight I'm actually headed to another Dave Lackey event and tonight we are celebrating the launch of Terry Mugler's new fragrance called Angel Muse. So I'm really excited because Nina, Westbury. I didn't, I don't, that was a weird cadence. Nina Westbury, um, she's a UK makeup artist who is living in BC. She has finally come to Toronto and she's actually going to be at the dinner tonight. So I'm really excited to hang out with her and it's going to be a lot of fun. So I will see you when I get downtown. I just got to the Arcadian Court and I'm wearing my glasses because it's good to see things. So let's go right in. Well, I guess there is another event going on, but here we go, or here we are. We are in the Arcadian studio today for the Angel Muse launch, so let's go in. There's Dave and Nina. Well, Heather in the back, obviously. I'm having a moment, though. Is it Mugler or Mugler? I suppose I will find out sometime tonight, but I don't know. I've been saying muggler, and if I'm saying it wrong, then I'm basically a peasant, and yeah, that's about it. I'll check in with you in a bit. I hope you can hear me, but I've just been informed that it's mugler, so not muggler. So apologies for just saying muggler the whole time, but it's mugler like a cat. So yay, learning! Nice to have so many great Twitter friends here this evening and, and to share this beauty of the experience. I want to start by thanking the Mugler team who flew in from Montreal. Thank you for being here. That's so wonderful. We so appreciate it. And what I love about this is, um, again, I mean, you've already heard the story that to share the beauty editor experience, like this is the, the dinners and the events that beauty editors in at Vogue, Harper's Bazaar, Glamour, all experience. So it's so great to share that with so many beauty enthusiasts. I'd like to welcome Heather Josie is here. So Heather, Heather is the buyer for fragrances for Hudson's Bay. So if you want to ask her any question, she knows more about fragrance than anybody. So it's great to have her here. So if you have questions and you want to ask, um, these are the kind of things that I've always wanted when I first started out, to be able to meet these individuals. So it's so great to have you here to talk to, talk to them. We have our wonderful City Line friends here. We have Candy yeah. City Line. Yeah. Yeah. And we have the lovely and talented yeah. Nina Westbury. Yeah. And she's going to share a Georgia May Jagger story with us later yeah. on. Hazelnut. Yeah. So we have that in our plate. And about the magnetic, of course, with the Vitiba. You know that Angel Muse is the first Vitiba gourmand. It's the first in the industry. Muglan has always been known for, you know, his spectacular fragrances. And also to always do some things that are so different. And things that... It shocked the industry. It's things that you would never see. In 1992 with Angel, this is what it was all about. And Angel Muse is also something very different because we've never seen something like that in the industry. And I think what's interesting is he, um, Terry doesn't design the collections anymore. David Coma does yes. for Mugler. But yes. he is still very, very involved. So in terms of the fragrance creations yes. that we Absolutely. see, Terry Mugler himself actually is very, very involved and sets the direction and, and the vision and signs off on it. And your mom's Jerry Hall. Yeah, right? Jerry Hall. Who and she's Mugler like... Mugler model, an angel model at the beginning. Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, awesome. she's just she like... She was there's something about her that you know she's in the room before she walks in. 
and she's like, but she says darling quite a lot, but like with this kind of like Southern American draw, which is so, it's lovely. Anyway, she came in with, um, they were both there together, and they were just really, really lovely, and very humble, and very polite, and I mean, this was probably about, how old, how old did you at the time? Like, this was probably, yeah, about sort of 14-ish. And you could tell that there was going to be something huge about her, even at that time, because she just carried herself her in the... Sorry? I love her teeth. Yeah, I love, I've got the gap too, so we're all like, Ooh, right? Yeah, I know. She actually thought that I was her older sister. <laughs> but yeah, it was really lovely, so I was really happy when I saw her, the, you know, the face and everything, because it's so wonderful to see people that are so nice, and that happens to them afterwards, you know, so... Yeah, she was lovely. I kind of want to give her my phone number. All right, sorry for the sort of weird dodgy lighting. Um, dodgy, can you tell I've been sitting next to someone from England um, all night? Yeah, basically, it was another fantastic event from Dave Lackey. Um, I actually got to sit beside Nina for dinner, and it was just awesome. I mean, it was just, you know, dreams coming true because I've waited so long to finally meet her, um, to have her do my makeup, and then just be able to just hang out with her. So like, Nina, I love you. I hope you get to come back to Toronto sooner rather than later. And, you know, thank you so much to Dave for this event. And of course, the Mugler family, which like I said, it's Mugler, not Muggler. So whoops. Anyway, uh, we got, you know, obviously, we each got a bottle of Angel Muse. And it actually smells really, really good. I mean, it's got that, when you first spray it, of course, it's like that sort of a really strong scent. Uh, I can't really, I, I don't, I'm not good with picking out notes, but then when it dries down, it actually smells very sweet, but not in an overly sugary and prissy way, if that makes sense. Like, I think it's that hazelnut, I guess, that makes it um, kind of like a swarm, swarm, kind of a warm type of kind of scent. So, Either way, I had a great time. Um, yeah, stay tuned for the next video. And thank you so much for watching. And as always, if you liked this vlog, then obviously give it a thumbs up. Um, shout outs to the two people who keep giving these vlogs thumbs down. It's every single Dave Lackey vlog that I do. There's always like two people who give a thumbs down. So shout out to you. I guess keep doing what you're doing. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Bye.